This is Canadian Cycling Magazine. I'm here with Hugo Uhl. Uh, it is the day after he rode to gold at the individual time trial at the Pan Am Games. Uh, it's the day after. How are you feeling about that gold yesterday? I feel pretty good. Like uh, it was a really great day to. Uh, like I came here as one of the favorites for time trial, and I put a lot of pressure on myself to, to do a good result. And uh, yesterday I was like really good legs, and I could have delivered a big ride, probably the fastest ride of my life. So really glad it's happened on that day, and uh, really enjoy my time here in uh, Toronto for the Pan Am. And you get a bit of a rest, uh, but in two days you will be doing the road race. Um, what are your thoughts on the course? I, I've not seen the course yet, but uh, I mean, we got a couple turns, and I don't know like how it's gonna play down. But I think it's more about how the, the guys gonna race. Uh, it's hard to predict what's gonna happen because uh, it's small team for rider, a uh, lot of country. I think Colombian sort of favorites because they got the Gavazzi that was the fastest sprinter. Uh, he beat Gavin this in San Luis a couple of times, so I mean he's, he's one of the favorites. So it, we, us, we have to be like pretty smart, like how to play our cards because we got, we got like four good riders. Guillaume is the sprinter, so we uh, we see how it goes. But at the end, he can uh, give the big push. Uh, myself and uh, Remy Wapensi, like we can go in the breakaway, and from there we got a pretty good sprint if we come with a small group. And then Sean, is all, he also uh, showed today that he's a strong guy, so he can ride a lot, or if he get a good, in the good move, can also do something. So uh, we're gonna see how it goes, but we got a, a good, a good number to play, uh, so I'm sure we can uh, do something good. Now you yourself were at St. Louis uh, this year, and so you faced some of these riders. Do you feel like you have a good sense of their their strengths and weaknesses? No, I mean it's really different when you race with your team, and then like it's not the same same pattern. Like everybody has his job to do, so you don't like. And I don't remember like everybody. Like it's just it's. I don't know all of them, so it's hard. I know some guys, like I have my teammate, like Carlos Betanco, that's gonna race for Colombia. So I know a couple of guys, but it's always hard to find, and everybody want to get this chance. So it's always like random show at the beginning, like everybody's attacking, and you just try to figure it out which one you're gonna follow or not. So uh, experience gonna be, play a big game there, and uh, hopefully we we have the good guys in a good break or or a good number at the end. But uh, we see how it goes. Now you're used to riding with bigger teams on the field, like uh, eight or, or, or nine at the Giro. Um, what's it like with four, or how is that going to change things, just having a team of four? Well, it's just you, you can't control the race with four guys, and nobody can control the race. So that's, that's why I say I don't know how it's going to play out, but it's for sure it's going to have attack after attack after attack, and then people's going to crack. I think you're going to have also a big gap between the best guy and the last guy, you know, so the field could be covered pretty small pretty quick so who's gonna ride who's gonna control like who knows like you know so I don't know and uh, yeah you've raced with some of uh, these folks before uh, you've raced with Guillaume on, on spider tech and have you raced with Remy before yes I raced with Remy when I was racing with Rick Arnaud like a couple of years ago I raced with Guillaume and spider tech we did a uh, we all did project all together uh, in the past. We win a couple of gold medal at the uh, uh, Canadian game, like smaller game with Guillaume and the Remy was there also. So we know each other pretty well, and uh, we're all here for the same goal to get a medal, and uh, we're ready to work as a team and respect like a uh, teammate, you know. So uh, I think that's what's gonna make our uh, like our best. Uh, uh, strong like you know if we work together we can achieve better thing so we see how it goes but we are four good guys and we see all right well thank you very much good luck on saturday thank you